What you mean? Magic they are mean, and she knows she's clean. What you mean? Magic on the scene. Anytime she step out, she step out to clean. Ah! Are you near magic? Tell them why you know near me, Fatty. Hi! I'm not sure if Safari will be able to handle having a new baby because I know he tends to run away from the responsibilities of just us having our one now. You look pregnant, but you still look small. Well, I've been working out consistently. I feel like it makes me feel a lot better just in general. <laughs> but um, I went to the doctors. Mm -hmm. They were able to tell me all the good stuff. The baby is fine. And then um, I explained to her your reaction. You know, Dr. Jackie's my girl. And she said it's very normal, right? <laughs> she was just like, well, when I told you, you stared at me for 10 minutes. And that's when it hit me. I have to actually be realistic about it because I was in shock. I guess I will say this. Forgive me, because I know I've been putting the pressure on you a little bit on your reaction. No, serious. Yeah, I'm serious too. But I still want you to understand where I'm coming from. You've definitely neglected me the first few months of her being here. I needed to sleep, and I wouldn't say I need to sleep too. I'm breastfeeding. I just gave birth. Do you know how much energy leaves the woman's no, body I after could, labor? I could, you know what? I had postpartum and a whole brand new human being that depends on us and everything we do for you to do everything. That kind of changed me, Maji. It did. We go from sorry to now a slight insult. Come on, we got to pick one. You can't say sorry and say, oh, I wasn't there for you. I wasn't doing this. I wasn't doing that. Like, I was learning. I'm just trying to be the best father I could be, all right? I just want you to step up to the plate and understand that this is your life. You have to be serious. You are a married man. You have a baby already, and you have another one on the way. So what's next now? We got to do a whole baby shower, gender party. Speaking we, of gender. How are we going to do this? Speaking of gender. I want you to promise that no matter what the gender is, you're not gonna, like, jump off the nearest bridge. I want a boy. Why do you want a boy? Because we already have a girl, a beautiful girl. You know if me. If it's a girl, would you really be upset? I would be... I mean, it runs in your would, family. Yeah, I would feel a way about it, and then feel when she... What way? What way exactly would you feel about it? I'd be frustrated. I'd be like, damn. Having a son? That would be like the most unbelievable thing. My family is all women. All my sisters had girls, so I have all nieces. I need a man to carry on my last name. I need an heir to the throne. You're supposed to be like, as long as it's healthy, long as my wife gets through labor. No, I know that, I know that, but you know. Like, you have to watch what you say. Like, sometimes I get it, you want to be funny, and you're I don't want to be blunt. funny, I'm just very blunt, and I'm very honest. <sighs> Do you want to know what it is or not? OK. What do you feel is in here? Anyway, you're having a son. Are you sure? Yeah, she showed me that. <laughs> <laughs> Safari, pick her up, you freaking idiot. <laughs> like, what's your problem? I'm freaking <laughs> Uh, she's, she's fine. See, when she's in here with me by herself, this don't happen. This moment is probably setting me up to get ready for what my life is about to be. Me having to hold down my babies by myself, even when they're hurting, because daddy finds it to be funny. But. It just proves how immature he is. That was a real dickhead move of you. It's your fault. Shouldn't have had her over there. I should have never had her over there? Yeah. Sorry, shut up. She's here throwing guitars on her head. And you're there laughing at her instead of picking her up. It was funny. I'm completely angry because I, I just feel like everything you portrayed yourself to be in the beginning is nothing what you really are. The baby fell. She's not hurt. Let's not turn it into nothing else. You got blessed with everything that you have in front of you right now. 
and you're not even mad enough to be grateful and hold it down like the way you're supposed to. She needs to know that there's pain in life. I'm dead serious. No, you're gonna find out that there's pain in life. <laughs> Hey guys, it's Young Jock here checking in with you right now. Do yourself a favor, subscribe to VH1's new love and hip hop YouTube channel to keep up with me in the love. Yes.